hello friends welcome to my channel today we are going to make a beautiful placemat i am going to use yarn of 3 colors for this project and a hook of 2.5 mm so we are going to begin with yarn of color a and with slip knot now we have to do chain 5 1 2 3 4 5 we have to go back to the first chain insert the hook in yarn over pull through both the loops this is slip stitch chain 1 2 3 which counts as a double crochet insert the hook into the ring pull through pull through two pull through two double crochet two three four we have to do 12 double crochet into the ring so complete the round and we will meet again when this round would be completed when we have completed doing 12 double crochet into the ring we have to join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch on the top of the four stitch we have to do chain 3 which counts as a double crochet chain 2 for chain space on the top of the next stitch double crochet 1 chain 2 for chain space on the top of the next stitch double crochet 1 chain 2 for chain space so complete the round by doing one double crochet on the top of each stitch but there should be chain space of two in between each stitch complete the round and we will meet again when this round would be completed after the end of the round we have to do chain 2 now we have to join the stitches into the third chain of the four stitch with slip stitch now we have to come to this chain space of two with slip stitch chain 1 2 3 5 counts as a double crochet double crochet 2 double crochet 3 chain 2 for chain space into the next chain space of two double crochet 1 2 and 3 chain 2 for chain space into the next chain space of 2 double crochet 1 2 and 3 chain 2 for chain space complete the round and we will meet again when this round would be completed After the end of the round we have to do chain 2. Now we have to join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch. We have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add yarn of color B from the next round. So pull through tightly. We have to begin with slip knot. Now we have to join the yarn into the chain space of 2 with slip stitch. chain 1 2 3 which counts as a double crochet into the chain space of 2 double crochet 2 chain 2 for chain space into the same chain space of 2 double crochet 1 double crochet 2 chain 2 for chain space into the next chain space of 2 double crochet 1 2 chain 2 for chain space into the same chain space of 2 double crochet 1 double crochet 2 chain 2 for chain space into the next chain space of 2 we have to do two double crochet chain 2 and two double crochet so follow the same pattern and complete the round we'll meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to do chain 1 yarn over on the top of the four stitch insert the hook in pull through pull through all the three a half double crochet chain 1 2 3 which counts as a double crochet chain 1 for chain space yarn over into the next chain space of 2 double crochet 1 double crochet 2 chain 2 for chain space into the same chain space of 
double crochet one double crochet two chain one for chain space into the next chain space of one double crochet one chain one for chain space into the next chain space of two double crochet one two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain one for chain space follow the same pattern and complete the round we'll meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to do chain one now we have to join the stitches into the third chain one two three with slip stitch chain two yarn over into the next chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space join the stitches on the top of double crochet with single crochet chain two for chain space into the next chain space of two double crochet one two chain two for chain space double crochet one double crochet two chain two join the stitches on the top join the stitches on the top of double crochet with single crochet to complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to do chain 2 now we have to join the stitches on the top of the fourth stitch with single crochet now we have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add yarn of color c from the next round we have to join the yarn of color c and we have to begin with slip knot now into the chain space of two insert the hook and pull through pull through two join the yarn with single crochet chain one two three four five six seven into the next chain space of two join the stitches with single crochet chain one two three four five six seven into the next chain space of two join the stitches with single crochet so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed after the end of the round we join the stitches on the top of the fourth stitch with slip stitch on the top of the fourth stitch chain three which counts as a double crochet chain two for chain space yarn over skip a chain on the top of into the next chain double crochet one chain two for chain space skip a chain into the next chain double crochet one chain two for chain space skip a chain into the next stitch double crochet one chain two for chain space on the top of single crochet we have to do double crochet one chain two for chain space skip a chain into the next chain double crochet one chain two for chain space skip a chain into the next chain double crochet one chain two for chain space skip a chain into the next chain double crochet one chain two for chain space on the top of single crochet we have to do double crochet one complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to do chain two now into the third chain one two three we have to join the stitches with slip stitch on the top of the fourth stitch chain three which counts as a double crochet chain one two three for chain space 
on the top of the next stitch double crochet one chain one two three for chain space on the top of the next stitch double crochet one chain one two three for chain space on the top of the next stitch double crochet one complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to do chain three now into the third chain of the fourth stitch we have to join the stitches with slip stitch now we have to come to this chain space of three with slip stitch chain one two three which counts as a double crochet double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of three double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space skip next chain space of three into the next chain space of three double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of three double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space skip next chain space of three into the next one double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed after the round is complete we have to do chain one yarn over on the top of the fourth stitch insert the hook and pull through pull through all the three a half double crochet chain one two three which counts as a double crochet chain one for chain space into the chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain one for chain space into the next chain space of two double crochet one chain one for chain space into the chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain one for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one chain one for chain space complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when the round is complete we have to do chain one now into the third chain one two three we have to join the stitches with slip stitch chain one two yarn over into the chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two on the top of the stitch chain one two three join the stitches on the top of the same stitch for five cord yarn over double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space join the stitches on the top of double crochet with single crochet chain one two for chain space yarn over into the next chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain one two three for pie cord join the stitches on the top of the same stitch with slip stitch into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space join the stitches on the top of double crochet with single crochet so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed this placemat or doily is going to look like this when it will be completed you can make a set of six or four according to the use this pattern grows very fast and can be a very good gifting option too thank you so much